Hey everybody, Marcus Crawford here with the Idaho Quadcopter Channel. Hey, I am out at Dubois Park uh, with a few people that you may know. Uh, we got uh, Mike Wright, Ron Brown over there, he's flying his drone. Captain Ray Kelly right here. And we, we're just uh, uh, a couple days away from the great South Florida drone meetup. Uh, but I've got the uh, Air 2S and I'm going to set this guy up and take off again. Yesterday I flew at the same location, but we're going to see if we can look at some different stuff. Uh, we got the Jupiter Lighthouse off in the distance, so for sure we'll probably do a lap around that. But uh, let's quit messing around. Let's get this bird in the air. Okay, before we uh, take off here, I'm going to take a look at the safety menu, make sure we're okay. So we're on bypass. Uh, We've got uh, return home height set at 35 meters, perfect for this location. We don't need any more than that. Max altitude, 115 meters, that's well below maximum. I've got no limit on distance, not asking for any calibrations, so we're good to go there. We are going to shoot in 4K, 30 frames per second, starting recording now. Boom, and uh, we're going to do an auto takeoff on the app. Here we go. Air 2S in the air, and, and now you would think, there's Captain Ray down there. I couldn't fly into him if I wanted to. This drone will not let me. So, uh, but let's, uh, let's quit messing around. Let's flip this guy around, and we're going to do our droney. So, uh, so there we go. What do we say, Captain Ray? Reverse and up now. Reverse and up. Into the wind. Yeah, so there's the whole crew right there. Oh, look at that drone flying. It, the wind was really whipping it around there. Yeah, yeah. So, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to head towards the, the Jupiter Bay uh, lighthouse out here. And I'm going to get in the shade, even though I got this, uh, this fancy RC here, I want to make sure I'm in the shade. You, you, you cannot, uh, you cannot fly here without going out to the lighthouse. We got a fair amount of wind today, so you guys will have already seen the uh, uh, UAV forecast. So it's pretty gusty. Got a lot of boats flying around here. Yeah, we got some wind. I'm seeing a little something. Oh no, I must have it in FPV mode. That's what's going on here. I've got this drone. I've got the drone in FPV mode. So let's go into settings here. I must have changed. Disable sideways flight. That's what I did. Okay, I did that accidentally. I saw that message earlier and I, I wasn't sure uh, what happened there. But yeah, okay, we're back to normal here. So uh, uh, when I, when I was uh, punching the startup, I hit the wrong button and I accidentally disabled sideways flight. And that's why we were getting that FPV style movement on the drone. So we got that taken care of. Uh, but the lighthouse here, the last time I uh, orbited uh, the lighthouse, I flew in the uh, counterclockwise direction. So, so we're going to go... We're gonna go uh, uh, counter -clock or clockwise and I am in normal mode so this is going to be a little more difficult we're going to test the test my skill here and see if we can uh, see if we can keep this guy in center of frame and we are and is that cool or what that's me dropping the camera down so we can see a little more of the territory here yeah that's pretty darn cool. You know, I fly around uh, cell phone towers in Idaho. It's a lot more fun flying around a lighthouse. That's pretty darn cool. So I'm getting, I, I, I saw some movement there on the, uh, on the camera there. Yeah, look at, see, look at that. We're getting that FPV style movement again. So I got something going on here. Disable sideways flight. Choo, choo, choo. Control, did I put it into? 
Yeah, it's in FPV mode, and I did not change that, so we're going to go into follow mode. I don't know why. I, I didn't mess with that at all, but anyway, so let's, let's click sideways here, and yeah, we're back to normal here. That was very strange. Uh, I don't know if it was something, you know, I, I, evidently I inadvertently must have hit that button at some point. Don't remember doing it. But at any kit rate, let's, uh, let's fly around here. Let's take a look and see what we got. We've got a direct line of sight on the drone. What I think is cool here is you got these houses that, you know, they're all have direct access to the ocean. Yeah, what do we got here? What do we got going on here? We got something going on at the uh, on the breakwater here. I don't know what this is. What 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 kind of a machine is this? I don't know if that's a. I I can't tell just by looking at it. I don't know if that's a dredge or or what it is. That must be a dredge. Yeah, that's got to be what that is. So that must be how they uh, dredge this area and and get the sand and then they'll take that sand and they'll make new beaches with it. Grab some more altitude. And look at this, we got a bridge up here. I don't know what bridge this is. Captain Ray would know. But boy, look at all these uh, look at all these ships, all these boats. I'm telling you what, this Air 2S is a phenomenal piece of technology. Yeah, okay, so I don't know, I don't know what uh, street this is, but I'm going to grab some altitude and then turn around and bring this guy back towards us. Let's see if we can move it around here. And we'll come back, but uh, I'll tell you what, I, this is the first time that I've been to this part of Florida, and boy oh boy do I understand the appeal. There is a lot to like here. And like today, it's windy, uh, however, very pleasant temperature, you know, it's in the high 70s. There we got a, a jet ski down there, or is that, yeah, that's a jet ski coming back. We've got boats coming and going. Yeah. So let's see, how fast are these boats going? We're, I'm in about, yeah, I don't know, five meters per second. So they're going about 12 miles an hour, or something like that. I'm just in normal mode and with the, with the drone, I can easily pass them up. Yeah, let's grab some more altitude. Oh, it looks like we got a party boat coming here or something. Let's take a look at this guy. Marcus, I'm coming back. Okay, Ron. I am way, way, I'm out there ways, so you're good. I hear the Ron Brown special, Mavic 3, coming in for a landing right now. So this is quite a little yacht right here. I am got a direct line of sight on him. I'm right behind him. Big American flag there. We like that. We like seeing old glory going. Got a looks looks to me like he's got a dinghy back there. Well, that's quite a machine. Quite a machine. And there's Ron, he's just landing right there off in the distance. Yeah, this guy is not, he's not going terribly fast, but when you got a machine, a, a yacht like that, you, it's not about the speed. It's about the enjoyment. Okay, let's head back on out. Let's see if we can get out over the ocean. Ron is landing right now. Come in hot. 
What do we got coming back here? That looks like a jet ski. Let's see if we can get down low. Get down, get down low, see if we can take a look at these guys. We're at full tilt. We're about, yeah, almost 14 meters per second. Yeah, look at those guys. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Got a good look at them. They're right in front of me. So this, folks, is open ocean out here. 60% battery here, so we're still in good shape. And I turned, last time I flew over this, I turned off this way. Uh, so uh, I'm going to, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to turn back the other way. But let's look, let's go the other way. That, uh, that, that big yacht that I was uh, videoing earlier is right in front of us now. And then we got some breakwater. That's open ocean you're looking at right there. That's the Atlantic Ocean. We don't have that in Idaho, I can tell you that. So, let's, uh, let's take a look at this, this beach right here. I didn't even look at this the other day. Yeah, let's move forward here and take a look. Boy, a lot of beautiful houses here. And we're staying over the water so we don't bug anybody there. You see people walking along the uh, along the beach, and looks like some more big old condos down there. It's funny when you look at the video, even though this uh, uh, RC Pro has a great big bright screen on it, when you uh, when you look at it uh, off the SD card, there's a lot of things you see. So if you hear me miss a landmark or something, it's because it's just not as easy to see. Uh, when you're looking at the uh, uh, looking at the uh, 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 the, the FPV screen on the controller, sorry. Some t some days I need to learn to talk. So I was going to go overland, but you know why would you do that when we got this beautiful ocean? And again, this is Dubois Park. We're at about uh, we're at about uh, forty six percent battery, so we're in good shape. We've been uh, filming for about 12 minutes. Oh boy, there's a fast boat coming in now. I wish I'd have been uh, in position to follow him. He is, he's hauling the mail. Would have been fun to see how fast he's going. So we're gonna come right down the inlet here. Let's throw this baby in sport mode and let's get her back. Sport mode, full stick forward. And we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna bring this guy down. And we're gonna do a high speed pass. High speed pass. High speed pass right now, guys. There we are, right there. The whole crew. Full tilt in sport mode. And here we go. Coming in hot, boys. Here we go. Coming in for a landing here. I just want to pay attention to my friends here. Make sure that uh, somebody's not taken off as I'm landing. Through the drone in cine mode, which I think is... Uh, 
probably a smart thing to do in a situation like this. Mike is uh, having a few issues getting connected to his drone. Let's, uh, let's bring this around. And there you can get, uh, you, can see, you can see Captain Ray and, uh, and Ron deep in conversation there. There they are. Hey, take that wire drum need up. Let's get it. Let's get a good look. <laughs> There's the man. There's the man right there. The the two biggest celebrities of the drone community right Where there. Two boys park. Two boys park. <laughs> okay, let's land this puppy. Back it up just Coming a little. Just go hot, the guys. other direction a little. Straight down on the stick. Straight down. Watch what you're doing there. Pick that camera up. Watch what you're doing. Boom. We're on the ground. Nice flight, Marcus. And not too bad. Not too bad. Give me just a second. Let me get everything shut down, and we'll do a quick conclusion. Hey, okay. We had a great flight with the DJI uh, Air 2S went over the Jupiter Lighthouse and we just kind of explored the area a little bit. Uh, I could do a lot of videos here. Uh, we saw some jet skis. We went out over the ocean. This guy's a champ. The only thing I don't understand is how those settings got changed uh, on my controller, but we got that figured out and we're in good shape. So uh, anyway, another day of flying in Florida. I'm just having a great time. So I guess that's about it. This is Marcus Crawford with the Idaho Quadcopter channel out. And if you like this kind of content, please consider subscribing to my channel. Most of all, I so appreciate you taking the time to look at this video. And yeah, we'll see you on the next one. Uh, bye from Florida. Hey, let's get, let's get a little bonus content. Time for a little bonus content, folks. Bonus. Bonus content. What do you got to say, Rod? Well, we're here, poor Mike Ray flew all the way from uh, Dallas, Fort Worth, uh, Texas, and he, we got him to the beautiful Du Bois Park, and his drone won't take off, Marcus. Yeah. D these DJI drones, Ron, they're just not reliable. I say go, if he'd have bought a Femi. He'd have bought a Femi, he'd be in the air. Flight would be over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Here, take it off. Uh oh, he's taking off. Here we go. Here we go. So you really get some bonus content here. You're getting a, 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 a drone pro taking well, off right you got now. A Mavic 3 flown by a, an R, a DGRC. Yeah. Because the RC Pro couldn't do the job. Well, yeah. There he's up in the air. Watch there the he goes. Watch the palm tree, Mike. <laughs> Watch the palms. <laughs> and out over the water. Oh, oh. Let me check out the way here. Watch, yeah, watch the water. Oh, watch the palm trees. <laughs> Where are you going, Mike? Oh, my God. I can't see it. Get a bump on the bump trees. I got top of the water again. I don't want to go to the water. Watch the pump. So what do you think, Mike? Go higher. Pump, this is like in the bottom. It'll avoid the trees. <laughs> Look at it go. Look at it go. Wow, that's crazy. crazy flying. Oh, 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 Mike, he doesn't mess around. Oh, Look wow. at this. Yeah! He's like a man man! <laughs> FPV Mike! Come in hot! Is, uh, is that. Whoa, is that... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at him! He's gonna go all over our head! Which bike <laughs> is this? This is crazy, Mike! Is this, is this Philly Mike? Is this Philly drone? Are you. He's not gonna hand catch that, is he? Oh! oh. <laughs> Look at that! So Boy, Look say, at that! Say that to Philly oh, Mike! That, yeah! Wonderful. That's what I call bonus content wow. right there. That yeah. Fun. That makes us look like amateurs. Yeah, well, well, Ron, that's because we are amateurs. Oh, well, I thought we're the pros on Drone Nation. Yeah. You want to hurry to leave? I want to check. I want to try switching controllers again. Okay. Yeah. Oh boy. I'm bound with this. I'm unbinding this. Oh time. boy. Mike's doing everything. Here. Hey, okay, guys. That's it for your bonus content on this one. See ya.